Alright, something that should have been at the scene, but wasn't. That must be the crucial point. Okay. Can I, uh, select? No. Start. What's the button to see my evidence again? R? No, 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 uh, not R. That's definitely bad. L? L does that. I don't know why. Okay. If we can figure out what that... Uh, if we can't just figure out what that something is... Oh, fuck me. Okay, so it's control stick and X. Got it. Hangman's Gambit. H I H. What the fuck is this? Okay, so if you shoot the wrong letters during the Hangman's Gambit, you'll take damage. If your influence gauge reaches to zero, you fail the case. Focus gauge. This determines what special actions you take. Concentrating by holding down the R button. Okay. Um, but I can't take too much time, I'm guessing. Okay. A and O. Hawaii. How? Who? What? Two letters left. I'm guessing that the yellow letters are some sort of indication. Her? No. Here. Here? No, that's not it. Here has an A in it. And that has an I. Uh, he? No. What the fuck? <laughs> Alright, so there's little letters at least, so that's good. Hi. Two letters left. Her. Her. Hot and her. Fuck. Oops. Oops. Alright. So A's not it. H. I. Miss! Fuck. Okay, so my left got you. Who? Miss. I'm confused. What the fuck's going on? <laughs> What? Okay, so wait, hold on. What's the? What was the? Uh, fuck. What's the button? Oh, fuck me. Okay. H something. It's not. R O. Oh fuck. Oh, I'm trying to aim. Oh, I think the colors represent the. Uh, okay. Higher. This is like fucking Wheels of Fortune all over again. <laughs> Snail mix. What's this shit? Ha. Huh. There's no two H's. Is this a word or what? Who? What letter- what word has an H and an I as a third letter? Her? Hira? Hari? Ha? Ha? He? He? Ya? He? Ya? He? He? Ya? I am so- I'm so dumb, aren't I? You shoot the wrong letters during the Heyman's game and you're- okay. Determine which special actions you take. By holding down the R button you can- yeah, I know. X or triangle, never mind, so apparently triangle button can be used after all. So it's not A, it's not O. Is it any of the vowels? Oh fuck, what was the other vowels that I didn't check yet? I checked A and something else. I think it was either O, I or O. Hoi? Hoi? I'm, I'm gonna shoot O. That's a miss, so O is out of the question. Is it really H? What kind of letter has two H's? Oh, it's not O. I shot you, but nothing happened. Fuck it, I'm dead. Uh, R. Uh, fail D. Well, let's see what happens when I game over. Nobody believes me. Nobody wants to hear what I have to say. Oh, we have already come to the end of the debate. Well, then the class has been adjourned. It's now time to reveal who's the black in. Who? Well, I kind of don't want to. If it tells me who the killer is, then... Then I don't want that, because we would know who the killer is, therefore we have that knowledge. I want them to show, like... Whatever. It's just, it better just show, like, a game over screen or something. I fear that you were the one most of Makoto. However, Makoto is not the black and too bad. It looks like the real killer got to capture congratulations. If another hands, everyone else will be punished! Is this... Let's say I want to give it another shot. There we go! Okay, good. So this is what happening after the trial or something. So we have infinite continues. Removing all sensibility of challenge whatsoever. <laughs> okay, whatever. Um, As things advance further in the class trial, the hangman's game... Okay, see, I'm so confused about this one. Is, are they forming a word or what? The point of this is to review the important phrases related to the incident in question. What kind of phrase has H and I on it? At least have some sort of word. You have to deduce the phrase 
from the letters flying around. The letters are already shown. Complete the phrase by shooting down the flying letters in the right order. Use the le okay. You shoot down the wrong okay. Yeah, I could just continuously shoot or something. Something that should have been at least like send me back to the beginning. Like in Phoenix, right? You have to be sent back to the beginning of the trial or at least your last save point in order to like that form of punishment. At least somehow punish me for not doing that because if I have to like just get back here, then there's really no sense of punishment whatsoever. Right? Something you should that should have been in the scene but wasn't. All right, so it's a phrase. It looks like a singular word to me though. Alright, Hangman's Gamut. And it seems like I have 5 minutes, so I, of course I don't have any time limit. So the H and I are still there. We tried A. It's not that. I don't think the colors mean anything aside from how many times you have to shoot them, so it's not A. Why you keep showing me A? It's not H. We tried that. <laughs> so it's either one vowel that we haven't used, which I don't remember, or it's R, because that's that's the letter that seems to be popping up. Did you, I, I don't think we tried O yet, have we? I don't remember shit. We tried A. Well, let's, try, let's try R just in case. No, R is a miss, so we can't do R. Is that a K? What the fuck is that? No, that's also an R. Do we just try every single letter now? A seems to be more prominent. Wait a fuck. Did we, did, wait, did we actually try A? a? No, so it's not hair. Never mind. Because I would have suspected, oh, the, oh, now I figure out it's hair, but I tried A and that's not it. Unless. What the fuck? I tried A, didn't I? Whatever, R. What the fuck? Now I understand. Whatever, I got that. Complete. That's right. There wasn't a single hair on the floor. There we go. So, the culprit removed some evidence? Well, that doesn't help my case, so. Yes. And if I were the culprit, why would I need to get rid of all the hair in my own room? It wouldn't be unusual at all to find my hair at the crime scene if the crime scene is in my room. The reason all the hair was gone was to remove any trace that Sayaka had ever been there. Triangle? Square? What's a button to hold it? Is Oh, or was it a different color? I keep forgetting. I'm guessing um, orange is um, just a color to... uh. Yeah, okay, whatever. So I had been, ever been Makes there. Sense. Does it not? No. If that were the case, they would have had to do something about the body itself, not just her hair. Yeah, I mean, dead body. You can't really hide that unless you somehow carry her limpless body to the incinerator. <laughs> yes, very true, very Okay, then why wasn't there any hair on the ground? The killer got rid of it all, of course, to remove any trace that they had ever been there. Exactly. Then that means... Precisely. It's simply beyond reason to believe that the room's owner and the killer are one and the same. Then, Makoto isn't the culprit? Not really. Are you sure we can decide something so important based solely on the absence of some hair? No. There are other reasons that prove why Makoto couldn't have done it. Alright, please do tell, Kyoko. I would like to hear these reasons. Tell me. Do you remember anything remarkable about the bathroom at the scene? Sayaka was attacked in the main room first, then fled into the bathroom, right? Right. Yeah. Then they ran after her, got into the bathroom, and stabbed her. And how did the killer get into the bathroom? Did they have any trouble with it? That is true. What do you mean? It's fairly certain that the killer had some trouble. Oh yeah, right, because I only me and Sayaka know how to open the lock, so they had to fucking break it. Derp. There was clear evidence left behind. Do you remember? Yeah, I remember. I just need to fucking get the words processed correctly, apparently. The killer struggled getting into the bathroom, and the evidence that proves it is... The object... Oh, never mind. I just had to hold it. Okay, the object that the killer broke. Uh, where is it? That. I got bathroom door. Objection! Or, take that! Take that! Evidence that the killer had trouble getting into the bathroom. You're talking about the doorknob, right? Huh? The doorknob? What doorknob? The doorknob for my bathroom. It was completely broken. See how the top part was unscrewed? And the doorknob's about ready to fall off? Oh yeah, true. But what does it mean? In trying to bypass the lock, they ended up nearly removing the entire doorknob. 
This is another most bewildering act for the room's owner. It proves Makoto is beyond suspicion. So what? You're saying he wouldn't break the door in his own room? Yeah, because I know how to open my own door. But if the only choice you have is to break it, you break it. There's nothing bewildering about it. Or you could just simply open it. You still don't see? Okay then, let's take another look at how the incident unfolded. Hopefully that will help you understand. Alright, Kyoko said it was a bewildering act. I almost didn't notice it at first, but is that the key point here? There's a bit more to learn about the non-stop debates! Okay, fucking hell, tell me, tutorial. From here on out, the number of the weak spots will start going up. But no matter how many weak spots, there's essentially only one lie or contradiction in that debate. What I'm trying to say is, not all weak spots you see are necessarily false. Okay, thank- it's weak spot, I know that. I play Phoenix Wright game. <laughs> Use the truth bullet on the wrong one, and not only will you fail to refute what they said, but you will also lower your trust with everyone, and your influence gauge will take damage. Now this is important because- yeah, yeah, I get it. Re-zero in your frame. You have to rely on your own logic to determine which weak spot are actually lies or contradictions. Well then, good luck and have some fun. Alright. So, of course, I had to really think about- Okay, so let me hear the entire argument now. Bathroom door frame. Got 10 minutes, so that's perfect. In Makoto's room. Saika was first attacked in the main room. Alright. She then fled into the bathroom. There, I don't see no objections there. It might be a weak spot, but... Alright. And they got into the bathroom. Okay. At that point, the killer had to try and bust down the door. Because Sayaka had locked it. No. And finally, the culprit had Sayaka cornered. Let me review the, what exactly it says here. Dying message. Makoto's bathroom door was difficult to open due to it not quite fitting in the door frame properly. The only two people who knew the trick to opening the door. Okay, so yeah. To finish the job, stab her with the kitchen knife. Alright. It was you, wasn't it, Makoto? Fuck you, Toko! Shut the fuck up! The answer. Yeah, I don't think she's gonna be my friend whatsoever. It's not because the door was locked. No, there's a different reason entirely. Alright. And the killer ran after it. Okay. And they got into the bathroom. At that point, the killer had to try and bust down the door. Yeah, he did. Sayaka had locked it. Uh... How do I... How do I... Oh no, a triangle, right? Oh, shit. oh wait, no, I had to sh Oh, I... Oh, that's where the reticle. I had to shoot the fucking word, okay. Blah, 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 Okay, so I actually had to shoot down the word instead, okay. Bam! No, that's wrong! Alright. There, it was impossible to lock it, I tell you. The reason my bathroom didn't open wasn't because it was locked. After all, the girls' rooms are the only ones with locking bathrooms, right? Yes, now that you mention it, that is true. Then, why didn't your bathroom door open? Because it was stuck. Huh? What are you talking about? My bathroom door doesn't fit in the frame quite right. Monokuma over there can testify to that. Yep, true as true can be. <laughs> We're gonna rely on our fucking... Okay. No, you're supposed to be the ultimate lucky student, right? But to have such a cruddy door... <laughs> Fuck so off. The reason the door didn't open was just because it was stuck. But the killer didn't know that and assumed it was locked. So they tore apart the doorknob to get in. Okay. Not only that, but the fact that Leon said it was locked. The door was locked in the first place. It was Leon the, that said Everyone that, right, by the way? You can't lock any of the boys' bathrooms. The killer could easily make that mistake. Thanks to one important detail about the scene of the crime. The killer was convinced the bathroom door was locked. So they didn't know the door actually couldn't be locked. Wait, what? Huh? So they didn't know that the door... Wait, hold on. Select. Is it? Okay. The killer was convinced that the bathroom door was locked. Alright, I'll take your word for it, game. So they didn't know that the door actually couldn't be locked. Okay. In other words, the important detail about the scene of the crime that they didn't know was... 
The crime took place in Sayaka's room. The crime took place in... Well, yeah, the crime took place in my room, obviously, but... In other words, the important detail about the scene of the crime is that they didn't know... That they didn't know was... Yeah, it's just... I mean, it's it clearly I obvious. I realized that it was my room. What? Are you saying the culprit didn't even know where he was? That's inconceivable. Well, we did have the the replacement of the thing, right? And yet, he's absolutely right. Say what? Well, to be more specific, what the killer didn't know was that Makoto and Sayaka had switched rooms, which is what led to the misunderstanding about the bathroom. If Sayaka had been in her own room, then... Then there would have been a lock on the door, and they would have had to break through! So they had no idea how unnecessary their actions were. Ultimately, we can't know if it came open by force or simply by accident. But, the killer must have been considerably confused, with no idea how they actually got the door open. Regardless, it was a pointless act. Wasting time trying to break down a door that wasn't locked is... Definitely something I wouldn't do, since I would have known exactly why it wasn't opening, right? That is a definite possibility. Yeah, fuck you, Byokuya, for so judging me. So would have to be someone who didn't know they'd switched rooms? Yeah. And Makoto couldn't have done it. Yeah, fuck you! You finally realize the truth now, bitch, huh? Huh? Yeah! Fuck you! If you can't tell, I fucking hate Toko. <laughs> If I were to try and attempt a murder spree right now, if I wanted to, Toko would definitely be my victim. Uh, that's what I've been trying to tell you, exactly! You did do it! I'm that's sorry, what but I give up! Quit without saving! Uh, triangle? Square? Thanks for the reminder, Peter Griffin. And with that, I'd like to wait until we get to the next part. The next episode of Dengadropa. Stay tuned for the next part, guys.